What's up everybody, it's Nars, and in today's fix, Sony PlayStation 5s are going to be even harder to find in 2022. Far Cry 6 Boss Insanity DLC gets a release day, and Rainbow Six Extraction pre-orders get a price reduction, and Deluxe Edition sports some cool new gear. <laughs> It just got even harder to get a Sony PlayStation 5 and will remain that way from now to early 2022. Sony has reportedly cut production plans for the console by around 1 million units due to component shortages and logistical constraints. According to a report from Bloomberg, Sony was originally targeting more than 16 million PlayStation 5 units to be produced by March 2022, but that has now been cut down to 15 million. Sony's chief financial officer, Hiroki Totoki, recently told investors that logistical issues and part shortages have grown more Severe with July sales of the console having fallen behind the pace of its previous console, the PlayStation 4. We know that an ongoing global chip shortage has resulted in massive delays for other electronic devices as the effects of COVID pandemic has made supply unpredictable. The Valve Steam Deck, the portable computer handheld, has also been struggling to meet its production schedule due to global supply chain issues and just today the Playdate handheld was also delayed into early next year. With 1 million less units in rotation globally, scalpers are going to have a field day once again buying and selling PlayStation 5s. Ouch. Next up, get to know more about the definition of insanity. Did I ever tell you the definition? of insanity with the first far cry 6 roguelike expansion boss insanity set to be released tuesday november 16th according to a press release from ubisoft michael mandel returns to play the iconic villain boss in a die and retry dlc where players will have nothing more than a pistol to defend themselves players will need to look for weapons and power-ups to become stronger and progress deeper into boss's psyche Fans will get a rare experience delving into Voss's past, personal demons, and motivation through intense action and storytelling. Voss and Santa will be the first of three episodic adventures, with each one focusing on a different Far Cry villain. The two remaining adventures will focus on Far Cry 4's Pagan Min and Far Cry 5's Joseph Seed, and will launch in January and March of 2022, respectively. Far Cry 6 Boss Insanity is due out November 16th and can be purchased as part of the game's season pass. And finally, Rainbow Six Extraction, previously called Quarantine, gets a release date and its price for the standard edition has been lowered to $39.99 USD. The PvE shooter spin-off from Rainbow Six Siege will come with cross-play, cross-save, and cross-progression and introduces the cross-play bundle pass which comes with two passes you can use to invite other players to play free for 14 days. This is pretty cool because any progression made will be transferred to the full game if the invited player decides to buy. Extraction mimics Rainbow Six Siege in concept but reimagines the competitive shooter as a cooperative one with players fighting off a parasitic alien threat. Ooh, cheapers creepers. In addition to the price reduction for the standard edition, the deluxe edition will now be $49.99 and adds three bonus packs. All pre-orders come with an orbital decay bundle, which includes two costumes and a weapon skin. Players who have played Siege will receive a united front bundle, including gear sets that unlocks in both Siege and Extraction and unlocking Extraction's operators within Siege. Happy hunting, operators. And that was your game fix for today, November 11th. Will you be picking up Boss Insanity or R6 Extraction? Let me know in the comments. Download the IGN app on all your devices. Follow the Daily Fix on Snapchat. And for all things everything else, head on over to IGN.com. I'm Nars, and remember to always stay fabulous.